Okay, question 18, the grand finale. So, in the region of England, the government decided um, to use an advertising campaign to encourage people to eat more healthily. Uh, before the campaign, the mean consumption of chocolate per person per week was known to be 66.5 grams with a standard deviation of 21.2 grams. After the campaign, uh, the first 750 available people from the region were surveyed uh, to find out their average consumption of chocolate. Part A asks us to state the sampling method used by the government. So, this whole thing was about uh, people in a particular region. After the campaign, the government have asked people about their consumption of chocolate from that particular region. So, this is opportunity sampling. Cool. Okay, A part 2 asks us to explain uh, why the sample would be inappropriate to conduct a hypothesis test on. So I would say there's two things here. First thing I would say is 750 is an incredibly small sample for a whole region of England. In the mark scheme though, their reason is that the sample is not random. So they've just sampled first 750 people that they've ran into. So it's not a random sample. Cool. And part B, six marks, it says a second sample of 750 people uh, was then taken and the mean was found to be uh, 65 Point four grams. We want to investigate at the ten percent level of significance whether the advertising campaign has decreased the mean consumption of chocolate per person per week. Assume that an appropriate sampling method uh, was used and the consumption of chocolate is normally distributed with an unchanged standard deviation. Okay. Okay, so this is a one-tail test because we want to know if the mean has decreased. So, H0 is that mu has not changed. So it's still um, 66.5. Our alternative is that mu has decreased. So it's less than uh, 66.5. Five. Now, we know that uh, sigma is still whatever it was back here, 21.2. Okay, so what we need to do is find our z value for this data. So, Z is X bar minus mu, I believe we're given it Here he is, so this is the guy that we want So we're in a sampling distribution And this guy is Z So X bar minus mu over sigma over root n. 
Sariot. Uh, X bar is gonna be heavy 65.4. Now we got that minus new, which is 66.5 over sigma, which is 21.2 over root 750. Now that gives us minus 1.42 Now what we also need to do is find the critical Z value so that means the value there such that we have an area of 0 0.1 on the left so we can use our calculators for this Go to inverse normal, put in the area as 0 0.1, the mean as 0, and sigma as 1. And we will get that our critical value is minus 1.28. Now our z value is less than that, so minus... 1.42 is over there somewhere. So, minus 1.42 is less than minus 1.28. So, because our z value is less than the critical z value, we reject h0 and accept. H1, and then we need to finish with a statement saying something like there is sufficient evidence that the mean has decreased. And with that, paper is done. Really hope you found these useful guys. Good luck in your exams. Take it easy. Take care.